بسم اللہ الرحمن الرحیم I have talked about the concept of the research then the different types of the research now I would like to talk about the qualitative and the quantitative research normally qualitative research is preferred or rather we people use it for social sciences particularly political science international relations language and linguistics literature etc and the quantitative research where facts and figures and statistical or numerical data is required or scientific research we use the quantitative research now first of all i would like to talk about the qualitative research which is generally applied in social sciences by providing an in depth study about the subject area its purpose is to gain an understanding of human behavior intentions attitudes and experience best and observation and interpretation of people it is carried out by taking interviews with open ended questions and observations qualitative research kisi bhi area mein for example in political science mein hum lete hain ke security system ya economic development ya political stability ya instability के बारे में बात करते हैं उसको किसी और वेरिएबल के साथ को करते हैं इसमें नॉर्मली मकसद जो है टू गेन इन अंडरस्टैंडिंग ऑफ ह्यूमन बिहेवियर इंटेंशन एट इट चूज ऑफ एक्सपीरियंस वगैरह एंड देट एक्सपीरियंस टू ऑन द बेस्ट ऑफ इज बेस्ड ऑन दी ऑब्जर्वेशन एंड इंटरप्रटेशन ऑफ पीपल इसमें कोई फैक्सिटी नहीं होती कि टू प्लस टू इज फोर आर न्यूटन आर आइंस्टाइन आर लाब ग्रेविटेशन आर बायल्स लाब और समर द बायोलॉजिकल डिस्कशन अबाउट ह्यूमन एनाटमी आर स्केलेटन सिस्टम एट्सेट्रा अब दिस इज डिफरेंट फॉर्म्स क्वालिटेटिव रिसर्च के डिफरेंट फॉर्म्स हैं एथनोग्राफी है फोकस ग्रुप है के स्टडी है एनामिनोलॉजी है साइंटिफिक मेथड है ग्राउंडेड थ्योरी है कंटेंट एनालिसिस है इंटरव्यूज है एंड सर्वेस है सो दिस इज अटल बिट अबाउट दी क्वान्टिटेटिव साल क्वालिटेटिव रिसर्च नो द क्वान्टिटेटिव रिसर्च इज आई हो जस्ट से the knowledge is based on facts and figures the numerical or statistical data and is applied for natural sciences which develops hard facts and numerical data it establishes a cause and effect relationship between two variables using different statistical computational and numerical methods cause our effect ke the main jo relationship establish karta hai parameters one ke liye statistical hoga computational hoga aur numerical methods honge as the results are accurately and precisely measured this method is also known as the empirical method or empirical research isme jo ki personal observation involved hoti hai experiments involved hote hain facts and figures hote hain unki scaling hoti hai isi wajah se in mein data jo hote hain wo perceptions ya attitudes pe depend nahi hote बल्कि 
ان میں فیکٹس اینڈ فیگرس ہوتے ہیں ان میں پلس مائنس ہوتے ہیں تو دیٹ از وائی دس از آلسو ٹرم ریز دی امپیریکل ریسرچ دس ٹائپ آف ریسرچ نارملی اسٹیبلشز جنرلائز فیکٹس اباؤٹ اے پرٹیکولر ٹاپک از از یوزولی ڈن یوزنگ سروس اینڈ ایکسپیریمنٹس اب جو کوانٹیٹیو ریسرچ ہے کوانٹیٹیو ریسرچ کے بھی کچھ فارمس ہے ان میں ہم بات کرتے ہی ڈسکرپٹیو فارم کوریلیشنل کازل کمپیریٹیو کواسی ایکسپیریمنٹل اینڈ ایکسپیریمنٹل So after a comparison between the qualitative and the quantitative methods, qualitative method may, it is used for developing a better understanding of human and social senses in understanding human behavior and personalities better. Now, the quantitative method here it is the method which is used to generate numerical data by using techniques, Ponce techniques such as logical, statistical and mathematical. So this is the main difference between the qualitative and the quantitative methods. Now, qualitative to it. It implies a subjective approach. Depend करता है. For example, कोई political stability की बात करता है. And he supports PTI in Pakistan. So he will have different opinion from the person who belongs to the PMLN or Pakistan People's Party or JUI or the PDM or any other party. इसमें ان ایلیمنٹ آف پرسنل لائکس اینڈ ڈس لائکس ہوتے ہیں جبکہ کوانٹیٹیٹو میتھڈ میں اٹ ہیز اٹین جاب آبجیکٹو اپروچ اس میں ان سی کیوز بیس کوسچنز ہوتے ہیں کچھ آپشنز ہوتے ہیں اس میں ٹو پلس ٹو ایز ایکل ٹو فور ہوتا ہے اس میں لاب گریویٹیشن ہے which is applicable each and everywhere so there is no personal likes and dislikes then thirdly qualitative method is generally expressed in words where is the quantitative method it implies the graphs and numbers stay ڈیپینڈ کرتا ہے کہ ہم اس میں مختلف گرافس وغیرہ جو ہے ڈیزائنز وغیرہ جو ہے ان کی شکل میں ہم کوانٹیٹی ٹو میتھڈ کو اپلائی کرتے ہیں اب کوانٹیٹی ٹو میتھڈ میں ایڈ ہیز اوپن اینڈڈ کوسچنز فر ایزامپل ہاو ڈو یو دی سیکیورٹی پیرامیٹر ان پاکستان Uh, do you think the political stability is linked with several military relationship? Uh, does inflation have any relation or correlation with the gold rates in Pakistan? Where is in quantitative, it has multiple choice questions. Similarly, Qualitative research needs only a few responders, but in quantitative research requires many responders. Quantitative may we take population of a larger size and out of that population we come uh, select some sampling etc. Then in qualitative data collection methods involves interviews, focus groups, literature review, ethnography, etc. But in quantitative, 
analysis are method. The data collection methods include, they are included are experiments, surveys, and observations, etc. Qualitative research is holistic in nature, whereas quantitative research is pluralistic in nature. Then some other points are the differences. Method relies on inductive approach. Qualitative method relies on inductive approach. In the inductive approach, normally we either generate a new theory or we develop the existing theory. At this level or at the research, it is very much difficult to develop any theory, but normally we add something to the existing theory. So we develop the theory, whereas in the quantitative, it relies on the deductive approach whereby there is the testing of the theory on the basis of hypothesis, etc. Now, next is the data taken in the qualitative research is non-measurable, it cannot be measured, whereas the data in the quantitative method is easily measurable. Next is the objective of this research method is to engage and discover various ideas. This is with regard to the qualitative approach, whereas in the quantitative approach, the main objective of quantitative research is to examine the cause and effect relationship between the two variables. Thank you.